Hello everyone, welcome back to Civil Engineering Academy. My name is Marina and today I'm going to be solving a problem for your PE transportation exam. The problem states like this, a truck is traveling at 50 miles per hour. The driver can observe the approaching train in a sight line that will permit the vehicle to stop before the encroachment in the crossing area. The train operates at 70 miles per hour, determine the distance along the railroad crossing. So this problem is asking us to determine the, this distance, d sub t, which is the distance along the railroad crossing. And for that, we're going to be looking in our Ashto Green Book on page 9-163. Uh, it's very important that you open the Ashto Green Book uh, to look at the equation with me because this equation has a lot of variables and if you don't have it open it, it's not going to make sense for you so please open your Ashton Green Book on page 9-163 uh, and, and then you're going to find that the D sub T is equal VT divided by VV like the, the VT is the um, speed of the train and the VV is the uh, speed of the vehicle this times a, uh, a is a constant and it is equal 1.47 uh, times vv times t. Um, this t is the perception or reaction time, which is uh, summed to be 2.5 seconds, okay? Um, plus b, b is another constant. Uh, this one is 1.075 times v, v squared. Uh, divided by A. A is the driver deceleration and this is assumed to be 11.2 uh, feet per second squared plus 2D where D is the distance from the stop line or front of the vehicle to the nearest rail which is assumed to be 15 feet. Uh, th everything that I'm saying is in our uh, Ashto Green Book on page 9-163, okay? Uh, plus L. L is the length of the vehicle, and this is assumed to be 73.5 um, plus W. And W is the distance between the outer rails. So for a single track, this value is 5 feet. Okay, so now let's start like plugging uh, our values. So our train speed is 70 miles per hour divided by our uh, truck speed, which is 50 miles per hour. This m multiplies um, 1.47, which is our A, times 50 miles per hour times 2.5 seconds plus B which is 1.075 times um, 50 squared divided by uh, A, 11.2, um, this is the deceleration, plus 2 times D, D is 15, plus L, which is 73.5 plus 5. And if you solve this equation, you're going to find that the dt is approximately um, 745. Um, now, there is another way that, uh, that you can solve this problem. It's by looking at this table that I put here for you. This is table 9-29. So you would have to see that this is the case A because um, we have the case where the vehicle operator can observe the approaching train in a sideline that will permit the vehicle to be brought to a stop. Okay, um, you can find this description on page um, 9-162. Okay, and the table, uh, you, you can find on page 9-167. Okay, so basically uh, we would uh, have to see here uh, this uh, train 
is operating at 70 miles per hour and our vehicle is at 50 miles per hour so we would go and find um, this value right here. In this case it's much easier just to uh, look at the table to get this value but uh, imagine if the problem had uh, given you the train speed of uh, 65 let's say the train speed is 65 miles per hour so this is not in the table so you would have to utilize the equation so keep that in mind um, i hope you learned a lot and i see you next time